Hey what is going on guys it's Sarge and in today's video we're going to be taking a look at the lens so drop a like on the video if you enjoyed and let's get started. Now the lens is a Massey rank 8 weapon that can only be gotten in a Tenno lab in a dojo so you will have to join a clan to actually get this weapon which is a pain sometimes since this weapon is very powerful for a bow. Now the damage on this weapon is very weird it has a 50 base impact damage when it actually makes contact with an enemy but it also has a 660 blast damage that it causes when it explodes on impact. It also does 10 cold damage to any enemy that gets caught in the explosion so you can slow down enemies even if you don't kill them. The crit chance on this weapon is 50% so it is on par with the dread and it also has a 2x multiplier for its crit multiplier and it only has a 5% status chance which is really weird for a weapon has an innate proc to not have a high status chance. Now a couple of key points to actually remember for this weapon. One, this weapon can actually kill you even though it is a bow. The explosion actually can cause damage to you and freeze you as well with the cold proc. So it's not really good to use this weapon in close quarters. It also only has six shots in its actual magazine. So you can only have six shots at a time. So you'll be collecting ammo a lot for this weapon. But with it only having six shots, it also has an NA ammo mutation. So it can't pick up any ammo type off the ground, which is good so any ammo type you pick up you will get bow ammo back to go with your six so you almost never do run out of ammo though you only get one shot back for every ammo pickup so it is kind of a waste sometimes and you could also stack it with other ammo mutation mods like the sniper ammo mutation so you can actually get more out of it per pickup now as for my build for this weapon i decided to go with as much crit chance as i could while also keeping the damage really high and adding some status chance so I can have multiple different status effects. So I can go with blast and corrosive and cold so I can have up to three different status procs. I also added vile acceleration to speed up the actual bow charge since it does take a little bit of time. It is at a 1.2 seconds just to charge up the bow itself. And it does lower your damage a little bit but it's not that severe since the weapon itself is pretty powerful. So that little drop of actual damage won't hurt you too much. But the overall build is pretty decent. I also have a discount version of this build if you don't have all the mods on screen. It doesn't have as many mods to put, but they are pretty easy to get these type of mods. So if you're newer to the game and you're just hitting Mastery Rank 8 and you just get this weapon, you could use these mods instead since they're just as effective to use on the weapon. So what are my thoughts on this bow? This bow is really good, but it's a very dangerous weapon to use in itself. It's very powerful, but you can get yourself killed very easily as well. So if anything, just use this weapon at your own risk since you will die a lot. Probably you will get down easily and you'll probably get laughed at a lot when you accidentally kill yourself when, with this weapon. So if you guys are new to the channel, I'd really appreciate it if you subscribed. It really does help out the channel. I'm trying to hit 500 subscribers. That would be freaking awesome and I'm actually getting there pretty fast and I'm really surprised since I'm not been able to post that much this week I did get a chance to put up my new TV so I'm not sure if the actual quality of my videos has improved since this is a 4k TV and I'm not sure if it actually improved the quality at all since it does look kind of the same from my perspective so that'll be the video for today guys I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to like favor and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video peace out